Hi folks, welcome to Trap and Snappers 2. I'm your host, Greg Cashneider. We're in middle Michigan and we've uh, spent eight days on the water trapping and preparing this how-to video for you. For anyone out there that would like to or you know has been wanting to trap turtle, snapping turtle, we're going to show you how to do it. We're going to show you how to set the traps, how to look for sets, uh, the habitat of the snapping turtle, how to find them, how to set the traps, how to catch them, how to handle them, and then we're going to show you how to actually busher them, uh, right down to the very last detail. Today is this, is this mesh bait sack, and what we're using for bait today, I like to use carp. I like to use solid carp, but what we're using today is salmon scraps from a real good fishing trip I had this last weekend. All right, now what we got here is that this, this is the trap that my grandfather made back in the 50s when they first started trapping turtle. Because the tighter you have the trap, the better off the, the turtle are going to be able to get in easier and harder for them to get out. But they can get out. If you don't get up in the morning and run your traps at daylight, they will figure out how to get out. All right, Monday morning. Get ready to set traps again. We're gonna set. Uh, we're gonna set six traps this morning. Okay, we got all the bait sacks in the traps. We got all six of them done. We got the bait sacks in. The front stakes in the trap already. Okay, what we got here is we got all this deep water right here. I don't know where this brush is going out over here. A lot of really great deep water structure. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Well, hello Jonesy. Where you been? Uh, turtle trapping, you know, it's not for everybody, but it is for the hardy at heart. All right, folks, this is the time where we're going to start the butchering process. So if you got young kids or some ladies or someone that's squeamish, you might want to get them out of the room. All right, folks, we're going to get this butcher process started. Now, I learned how to do this from my grandma. She was cleaning turtle back in the 60s, and I think probably earlier than that. All right, folks, today we're in the kitchen, and we're going to be doing the recipe that I was talk to you, talking to you earlier about. We're going to be doing turtle backs in a golden portobello mushroom sauce served with wild rice. It's one of my favorite dishes. And there you have it. And there you have it. You have it. It's a beautiful thing. It's turtle backs in golden portobello mushroom sauce and wild rice. One of my favorites. 